Brisbane State High School was established in 1913, moving to its current site in 1925. And it's on this site that the latest development has evolved. We've got the Year 7 redevelopment here. It's a six-storey building, two levels of car parks, three levels of offices, classrooms and uh, commercial space. Brisbane-based Precast Concrete Group became involved in the project at an early stage. For the uh, Brisbane State High School, it was uh, four floors uh, with approximately 50 beam shells and 250 holocore each level and therefore it was about 250 beam shells and up to about a thousand holocore planks. Broad the builder contacted us um, very early in the job as they were tendering the job looking for an alternative design to the in situ traditional form of construction. Um, prior to that the engineers that they had um, considered using on the job had given them a precast option and we coupled in with that and uh, provided a solution that would save them a lot of time with their construction and, uh, and all the added flow on benefits that come with it. I think this is the first precast flooring system that this particular building team have used but they went through a quick learning curve and uh, to the point where they're very very happy with the amount of time that they've saved. We've hit all of the targets, we've hit all of the milestones that they wanted to hit from the beginning and uh, the time savings that they initially wanted have been achieved. So obviously the main challenge that we've had here is using the precast system, it's a new system for all of us here. And for the crew on site that also presented some challenges. The reason for both the builder and the installer only now learning about precast flooring is that the Brisbane market is somewhat inexperienced with the method of construction. The Brisbane precast flooring market is a, an evolving market. Um, in the past there's been people that have had a go at flooring here in Brisbane but it's never really taken off in a big way and probably part of that is not having a suitable facility like we have these days with the modern holocore plant that we've built here. Having learnt quickly how to get things done, the team is happy with the precast flooring approach. It's a very simple process really, like once, once you've installed the planks you, you don't have any other worries type of thing, it's like a big Meccano set. And the incentives for the construction team were simple. I think the main driver for Broad was construction time. They wanted to reduce the, uh, the construction time on site, which we've been able to do on that project. But one of the other great spin-offs that comes with the precast flooring solution is the, the reduced number of men on site. And that's a huge advantage in an inner city site and um, all the associated benefits of safety that go with that. This doesn't mean it didn't present some challenges for the precast supplier. The handling of the beam shells because they were very long and, and quite slender elements and because they were uh, pre-stressed uh, they had to be handled in the correct way so that they weren't damaged uh, during off-moulding, uh, transportation and the installation of them. The basement of the high school is designed for storage and car parking. It's here that you can really see the space benefits of precast construction. Traditional formwork would be completely clustered downstairs with your H-frames etc and you wouldn't be able to get in there until the concrete's cured X amount of days. Um, no services, no one can pretty much get under there. But with this system you've got your formwork in just through the beams. Once it's removed that's it um, and our services are going in pretty much the day after the pour. Speed of construction, safety, numbers of crew on site and reduced materials all contributed to a smooth build. So we've got less crew, so there's an increased speed to get the job done, minimise Rio, formwork and concrete. So that minimises our numbers on site, obviously. Um, also with the minimised numbers, we've got a smaller site team. So that also helps a lot. Safety side, it's um, a lot cleaner on site. No formwork there, so I've had a lot of visitors here on site. They're real surprised with how tidy the site is. Not really cluttered. There's a lot more space to uh, store materials and stuff. Um, our trades are getting in there straight away. We find that when we've um, already won a customer over to a precast solution, that from then on that they engage us very early in their tender and look at a precast solution. But then there's other jobs that come out to tender in traditional formwork and then we have a job to do to convert that as quickly as we can to a precast solution. Some of these types of projects are designed in in situ concrete. So we get a hold of it very early during the, the pricing phase and uh, we can put forward proposals to the, to the builder and um, to try to expedite his job and uh, make it quicker and easier for them to install and therefore the building goes up quicker overall. Colin, Ricky, Michael and their teams are happy with the outcome so far.
The high school is due for completion at the end of 2015. Broad's a builder that wants to do more and more work in the Brisbane market and we want to do more and more work with them. So it's been good that this first project has gone so smoothly. For a list of precast flooring providers and more information, go to www.nationalprecast.com.au.